Hi everyone, welcome to Dharma Earth's Dose of Dharma, and this is your Dose of Dharma for today. Swakato Bhagavata Dhammo Sandetiko Akaliko Ehipasiko Opanaiko Pachatang Veditabo Vinyuhi. So, this is the stanzas used for recollection of the Dhamma. So, what are these? It consists of a few uh, qualities. Eh? Swakato is one, Sanditiko is one, Akaliko is one, Ehipasiko is one, Opanaiko is one, Pachatang Veditabo Vinyuhi is one. Okay, so what is Swakato? Swakato means well expounded. So why is it well expounded and what does it refer to? Well, it actually refers to the Dhamma consisting of the Magapala, the four Maga, for Pala, the Nibbana, and the Pariyati. Pariyati means the theoretical teachings of the Buddha. But even though it is theoretical, but it can be realized through practice. Okay? So this Pariyati is also well expounded. So the Maga, Pala, Nibbana, and Pariyati is well expounded. That's why it is called Swakato. Why is it well expounded? Because it is excellent in the beginning, excellent in the middle, excellent at the end. And in accordance with the rules of uh, the grammar, which is the Pali grammar, which they believe is also the Magadan language at that time. Okay, Then also because it shows uh, the middle way, avoiding the two extremes. What are the two extremes? One is the extreme of uh, indulgence and sensual pleasures. The other one is the extreme in self-torturing uh, and self-modification. It shows the middle way for the practice and also because it quills the fires of defilements and completely extinguishes them. And lastly, because it explains about the nature of permanence, stability, pacification and deathlessness. That's why uh, the Dhamma is well expounded, Swakato. Okay? In the next few talks, we will talk about the other qualities as well. Hmm? Okay, so this is your dose of Dhamma for today. We should all of you to be well, peaceful, and happy. And may the Triple Gem bless all of us to be able to attain path, fruition, and Nibbana as soon as possible. Sadhu, sadhu, sadhu.